Peace, love, and light, family. It's your girl, Ada, coming to you here live in a living color with Zion today with another informative topic and video. Good morning to everyone. We are almost there. Um, I hope everyone is enjoying their day and that everything is going well for everyone. But this particular segment is going to be a short and sweet topic. Um, you know, we live in a society where today... Um, you know, I don't identify myself as black. I am not an African American. I do not hold true to a lot of these movements that are going on out here. But what I'm going to talk about is a rewind in history of flashbacks, if uh, so to speak. Um, what you see right here on my screen right now is a laughing barrel. A laughing barrel. Let's take a time, a step back in time to look at what a laughing barrel was. And I'll go ahead and post the article below. But this plays out into who we are right now as a people. Laughing barrels were made for the slaves on these quote unquote plantations. And we know that they've fabricated history a great deal. But anyway, it was for quote unquote black people that if they wanted to laugh or make some type of expression or shout or anything, they had to run to the barrel, stick their heads in the barrel and laugh. If this is not inhumane treatment, I don't know what is. And like I said, I don't want to set the tone this morning for anger or build up, but see, we need to not forget this. And I'm going to be working on some stuff with um, bringing out more information, a series leading up to Memorial Day and how we are not to forget all the things that they have put on us as a people and to our ancestors. We weren't even allowed to laugh or hurt any type of emotion. And see, this goes to show here today, we as quote unquote black people, skinning and grinning, dancing, buck dancing, just Oh, having a good old time. And we have nothing to laugh about. We are in a really, really bad situation in place right now as a people. What the hell are you laughing at? This is not funny. Our women are dying. Our children are dying. One against each other, and then we've got the enemy on us. This is not a laughing matter. But yes, these laughing barrels were created to, um, you know, hide the face of the slave as this person laughed. Laughing barrels is what it's called. And you still have a lot of quote unquote black people out here that are laughing, that are happy. And it's just like, what the hell are you laughing at? I'm sorry, but you cannot program me into being happy when I'm not. And nothing is going on in regards to us as a people getting out of this situation. We are the most happiest people on the quote-unquote quote quote planet, yet we are the most displaced, the most disregarded, the most disrespected on the face of the earth. But I just wanted to share that with you guys, the laughing barrel throughout history and what that meant for us as a people, how we weren't even allowed to laugh or show expression because the quote unquote slave master said that it, it, it showed weakness and we weren't even allowed to laugh. But yes, family, I just want to bring this forth here about the laughing barrel and we should not forget what our ancestors went through. And we should not forget to teach it to our children. And I wanted to bring this up. Peace, light, and love.